Okay, this is Pete Peppers, and this is um, a tutorial video on the fifth and final level type for now, which is the Honey Levels. They're introduced into the game in level 76, and they work a little bit differently than the other level types, so we'll just talk about how they work. Alright, so it tells us we have to eat the honey and save the bears. So, you can see that there's honey squares that are similar to ice um, in a lot of ways. And when we make matches next to the bears that are trapped in honey, they are set free. So you can see on this level we need to collect 30 of them. And these bears, these honey bears here are already at the... Um, they're already ready to be released so they come out with just one match but as you progress um, there'll be other ones that are buried deeper inside the um, honey as well it's pretty straightforward um, they work like I said very similar in a similar way to how find the bears levels work except for with those you have to clear off the tiles by making matches on top of them and in honey levels, you just have to um, you just have to make matches next to them. So they're sort of like raised tiles, and um, they work a little bit differently. So that's a simple one. Let's look at one more real quick to show how they can be um, trapped in much more difficult situations. Just to find one real quick here. Okay, so these bears, you can see they're a little bit more obscured, and they're sort of off the screen. This is a, a this is a double layered hunting square right here. So this would take two two matches to break free. And you can see the candy moves around in a circular motion and in order to get to these ones we're going to have to make fish or striped candies so you can see that this gets a lot more difficult fairly quickly so you can see I hit that bear once and now it, it's raised up to the surface and it'll, it'll be free the next time it gets hit. <clears throat> it's interesting on these levels where the um, where the tiles go in different directions or the candies move in different directions, I should say, it's, it seems simple enough that, you know, the, um, that you'd be able to follow it, but since, at least for me, uh, since we've been playing match three games where everything comes down all the time, you, you really have to take a second to think about how, um, the pieces are going to move. So you can see we got that one out by hitting it twice, the fish, hit them once and it brings it up to the surface and a little bit later we'll get into levels that have even thicker layers and we'll just look at one of those real quick That's one of the hardest levels in the game right now. I know it has um, 
I'm really thick on it. Okay, so here you can see the honey has kind of the honeycomb pattern on it. So like on the first board on this one, the bear we need is right here. And it's this will take three hits to free um, because it's not the thickest. And maybe this one, yeah, it'll be three. This would be four, and this would be actually five. That's the thickest. And we actually got a really bad start on this where I can't make matches on that side at all. So, Luckily I'm not trying to play the level to completion. I'm just trying to show you how the different layers of ice works. Or honey works, sorry. You can see that honey sometimes will... Um, so that was one hit, two hits, and then the fish gives you the third hit. Sometimes honey will conceal special candies and things like that that you'll find as you break it down. So honey levels, um, like I said, they're the last ones that were introduced into the game. I wouldn't say they're the hardest, but some of those levels are really hard. Um, when you look at it, you just can tell, like I said, um, these ones are, would take two hits, this would take three hits, and there aren't any four hit ones on here, but this one will take five hits. So depending on how thick the the, the, um, the honey is, it tells you how many hits you have to make to free that square up. And when you're looking for bears, if they're on the thinner honey like this one, the two layer, you'll be able to see the bear. Just like in the ice when it's down to one layer. But when it's in these thicker ones, you can't see it. So you all, a lot of times you'll have to try to pay attention to where you found the bears the first time and go after them that way. So if you have any questions about honey levels and how they work, leave a comment. Please like the video if you found it helpful. And visit our site, CandyCrushSodasagaTips.com to find out everything about how this game works. Thanks.